All right, guys, we're here and back for the final fight in past Path 3 of the Abyss against the Collector. Now, I again, just like all the other fights, you, there's not a lot of time to practice the Collector. I've gotten a little bit better of, uh, you know, baiting his uh, special 2 without getting crushed like that. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, there, there's not much, uh, there's no sugar coating it. It's rough. It's like, uh, a little over, uh, you know, like, uh, 20, I think it was 23 revives to get through them. Uh, I just threw the rest of the team at him at the beginning just to, uh, put any dent in there, but really Aegon's just going to do all the work because at least I can, uh, attack right into him pretty much and with the 999 combo and, you know, also try and pull off the, uh, you know, the charging the heavy and get off uh, some big damage at the beginning of the fight if it if it works. I'm not always great at doing that, but uh, you know, for the most part, uh, we get through this one. Throw in as much uh, extra damage here at the beginning as possible with the uh, the other teammates, and then uh, it's really just uh, an Aegon show for the rest of it. It's, uh, you know, at least it's good practice and I can, you know, I hadn't recorded any of the other uh, full fights uh, for the other two times I did uh, Abyss, so hopefully for the fourth one I'll have a little bit more, uh, you know, be able to go back and look at some of these fights and hopefully it helps out anybody else who wants to see what they're up against when you're not, uh, you know, the, the greatest uh, player, but, the, you know, you know, maybe average to above average player and going in and what you can expect to when you finally uh, get this far far in, there's really no turning back and you're just going to power through. And, uh, you know, I think overall, um, if I do the count correctly, um, I guess there are two fights that are not on my playlist because they're the same fights over and over, like so two fights that we already had. I think it's the champion and Havoc. Um, both of them are in there twice. They're the exact same fights. Both fights worth it are pretty much exactly the same. Maybe a revive or two here or there um, difference. But I like uh, so. I think in the end, I was um, a little over maybe a hundred around 110 revives for the path. And uh, you know, I don't think this is a, an easy path. <laughs> But, uh, you know, uh, it gives an idea of, you know, what I, what I'll probably be looking for, for, uh, path four in terms of, uh, revive farming and, uh, see how many I can put together, um, along with, uh, units and see when we can, uh, you know, maybe by the end of the year, do another, um, aim to do another path of the abyss, maybe over the, uh, Maybe one time during the uh, winter break that uh, nobody is taking due to uh, the current situation everybody's in. So, so uh, enjoy know, the of rest of at home the fight of, of me getting my and, butt kicked uh, by the collector. Uh, and uh, we'll good. see you in the next one where it can actually, uh, you know, get some damage in, bait some heavies, you know, actually uh, not fully evade, but at least uh, counter his uh, special two there. So that was, that was pretty good. So at least I got, uh, I think the first time I did, uh, I did it, I couldn't even do that. So, you know, each time you do them, you kind of improve a little bit of your game so that by the time you get to your last couple runs, you can uh, shave off some revives. So uh, hopefully next time we'll, we'll aim to do it in, in less than 23 revives and we'll see what we can do. So that'll be the, the goal and we'll see if we can uh, surpass that for the next one. 